Hey guys, welcome back to Sticks in the Sticks and another installment of How to Tie Fishing Knots. Today I'm going to show you how I tie the double uni knot. The double uni knot is, in my opinion, one of the best and most versatile knots to join two types of line together. It doesn't matter the type of line, strength of line, or thickness of line, this knot will work and it maintains pretty close to its full strength when the line is joined. First I'm going to show you the concept of the knot with some rope and then I'll be moving on to showing you how to do it with some braided line tying it on to monofilament. So here I have my stand-in fishing line. First, what I do is I grab the tag ends of both my lines and have them opposite like this. And you take the one line, like so. I usually go about halfway. I just pinch it so I can just hold on to it. Then you take, I usually take the bottom one and you bring it around like so. So you have a, a loop like that. Then I take this little tag end and go twist it around both lines and into the loop. You can twist it a few times, I'm just going to do three in this point. Then it will make a little knot like that that will slide around on the other line. Next you take your other, your other tag end and I usually just rotate the line so that my other tag end is below the line that I'm going to be tying it on to. So same concept. You bring it around, you make a loop, like so. Then you take the tag in and wrap it around both lines through the loop a few times. I'm just gonna do it three times here. And then tie it tight. Then you'll have another slide line, like the line will slide on each other. But then when you pull, pull them tight, it comes together like that and then you can cut off your tag ends and there you have your double uni knot. Here we have our monofilament and some braided line. So just like with the rope you have your tag end for the mono and then the tag end for your braided line. I I overlap it probably closer to a foot just because it's just a little bit more line to work with. Um, so having said that, I usually grab it about, pinch it about halfway between the overlap and I start with the braided lines tying that around the mono. I just find it easier. So same concept as with the rope you're gonna take your tag end and you're gonna make a loop like so so you have your mono you have the loop you made with the tag end and then you take that tag end and you wrap it around you twist it around both lines like that and you do it numerous times there's no real set number but I find if you do a few more like like six to eight um, with the braid it, 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 it tends to work well then you grab your little tag end of your braid 
you can take your main line for your braid and you pull it tight and you have a little knot like that that would it actually slides slides on the monofilament then I go to the monofilament side and it's the same concept I mean your lines are gonna get twisted up a little bit here but it's not the end of the world you take your tag in for your monofilament and again you make that same make that same loop so it looks something like that then you're gonna want to make twist it around a few times around both both lines I find for mono you get again about six to eight times so you end up with something looking something like that then you hold on to your tag end and you pull your main line I know your line's gonna get looks like it's gonna get all twisted but that's okay then you're gonna want to wet that knot like with all monofilament knots get some water on it or or something like that just wet it that way when you do tighten it it uh, it cinches it cinches nicely so you pull your main line and then when you pull the two knots together they both will cinch up nicely like that and you then you can go ahead and trim off the excess with scissors clip nail clippers or a relatively sharp knife and you can cut them off nice and short like so and there you have it you have your double uni knot with monofilament and braid so there you have it guys the double uni knot again it's a very useful versatile knot to join two lines together of different types sizes and strengths and it maintains the strength within the knot really really well and again like all the other knots if I can do it with these stubby fingers anyone can do it Thanks again, guys, for watching. Um, I really appreciate the views. And if you did like the video, hit the thumbs up button. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, please subscribe. It does help out the channel. And until next time, bye-bye. Get the boys just enjoying the sunshine. Here's Winston. Here's Gus. And Rusty's hiding around the corner there. You can see his tail. <laughs>